Hey, how's it going guys? It's Eric and welcome back to a brand new Bioshock video. Now I will be referencing a video in particular that I made quite a long time ago. It'll be down in the description below or it'll be at the end of the video and you can actually click on it on screen. And it was about Sean Elliott. He was a level designer, I believe, for Bioshock Infinite. Then he left for Arcane Studios when Irrational shut down. Anyways, I digress. It's almost been an entire month since I mentioned anything about Parkside or since I've made a video about Parkside. And thankfully, a subscriber of mine in my Discord showed me this LinkedIn. If you guys don't know what LinkedIn is, essentially it's a professional credential site you state your job you state what you do where you work your experience etc and you can see his on the screen now at the time that i originally made the video it was just news that he was returning back to 2k along with another developer from a different studio coming back to 2k and the two things that these guys have in common are one they worked on Bioshock Infinite, and two, they had a really big say in the levels of Bioshock Infinite. Again, I digress. So, as he showed me this screenshot, he actually has been promoted. And I'm not sure how recent this is, it might say it on screen, but it is also 5.30am, and I needed to get this video out to you guys. So... As you can see, Sean Elliott, previous works, 2K, Arcane Studios, etc. With 2K games being his primary workplace. So, he was a level designer before. And as you can see on the screen right now, he is a lead game designer at 2K. And he's working at the Novato office. If you guys don't remember that or if it doesn't ring a bell, that's the new one that Michael Condry is actually taking over and that's the rumored location of where they're actually making Bioshock Parkside. So this gives us a little bit of hope. Why do I say that? Well, you have Sean Elliott as the lead game designer. so. I suppose he's going to be in charge of the overall gameplay, the overall level designs, etc. Now in terms of the creative director, I have no information on that whatsoever and I do apologize for that, but I will give you guys information as soon as I can. So like I said, I was going to keep you guys up to date with Bioshock Parkside information when I had more reliable sources. And LinkedIn is one of the most reliable things in terms of professionalism that you can find on Google. If you want to check out his actual profile, I'll leave a link down in the description for you guys. And I'll also leave that video in the comments for you guys. So hopefully, fingers crossed this is a good sign but anyways with that being said thank you guys for watching today's video if you did enjoy it and would want to help me out would you kindly drop a like it helps the video get out there and it helps the channel grow and speaking of growing if you want to join the rapture family or help the rapture family grow would you kindly hit that subscribe button turn on notifications to never miss a video or a live stream when it goes live and feel free to share it on social medias like Twitter, Facebook, Reddit, etc. Completely up to you guys. Also, if you want to follow me on all my social medias, or join my Discord, or check out some of the most badass playlists that I have, all the links will be in the description below. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to go to sleep. It's 5.30 in the morning. So, with that being said... Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, rest of your night, whenever you're watching this. And I do appreciate you guys with all of the kind words on yesterday's video. It really does mean a lot. So, 
thank you guys. But anyways, with that being said, I will talk to you guys in the next video. Take care.